I'm Gus Gazard. I'm the Chief Investigator for the LIGHT trial uh, and the Director of the Glaucoma Service here at Moorfields. Five, six years ago, wanted to see whether a laser treatment for lowering eye pressure would work as well as using eye drops. What we found was that using laser, a gentle focused light treatment to the front of the eye that doesn't hurt, it's very painless, as the first treatment for glaucoma, was able to keep people off drops, well controlled, with good eye pressures for three years in over three quarters of patients. But it's a cheaper or a less costly treatment than the eye drops. If we did this treatment for everyone across the NHS, we'd probably save around a million and a half pounds a year. But if we did this for all of the patients who already have glaucoma, then we would probably be saving tens of millions of pounds a year for the NHS. And for the patient, it means that they can have that, press, that pressure controlled with just a focused light treatment once, twice, maybe three times over a period of many years with no medication. The results that we've just had published in The Lancet are the three-year outcomes, which was the planned length of follow-up for the study. Because we were able to recruit the patients on time to target and look after them well and keep them in the study, so we've been funded for an extension to that project. And we're very grateful to Moorfields Eye Charity for helping us to fund the continuation of the project and to keep going for a further three years. Uh, we're also very grateful for funding to be able to look at the genetics of eye disease and glaucoma in particular and hopefully be able to start to untangle how there's a genetic component to whether people respond to eye drops, whether they respond to laser and who these treatments work best for.